the Empire of the Black Sun has been finally reformed. Everybody and welcome back to another Age of Civilization 2 video with Germany in World War II here on the channel. We are back today stronger than ever and we are going to dominate the world as the Empire of the Black Sun. Let's do this. Okay so as you can see, we are already going after and are about to conquer Denmark. Then, we will impose our rule over the rest of the Scandinavian region. Let's go. Time to prepare an army for the invasion of the UK, though first. This should be a piece of cake. Sorry about that. Anyways, the UK is really falling. Way to go. Oh no, an event popped up and I clicked too fast. Now the UK is my subject, but only the mainland and I have to annex them again later. What the YouTube, please don't demonetize me. Thanks. Also, guys we just reached 425 subscribers already. I can't thank you enough. But you have to remember again to subscribe because we are closing in on 500 subs fast. Do it now, it is free and you won't regret it. You can always unsubscribe later. Thank you. Okay, enough with that, basically, UK is ours, going after the democratic part of Norway and then after Sweden finally. I am telling you, Sweden will fall, and then we will enforce our ally Finland to join us land wisely, and then we will invade the communist bastard of Norway. Again sorry about that YouTube. As you can see, the empire of the black sun has been finally reformed. It's democratic for some reason, but we are going to keep it that way for now. We are going to be fascists undercover. So while I was talking, you can see that Sweden is completely falling to us. They can do nothing to stop us now. Let's go. And that's the end of Sweden. By the way Finland and a bit of the Soviet Union are inside of our territory, so let's take that from them immediately. I can't believe how powerful we are. We are so powerful that we can almost annex every single country by any ultimatum. It's bloody extraordinary. It's wicked. While we are trying to invade the communist Norwegians, some rebels are, well, rebelling. That's nuts. Why would you want to escape from a democratic nation like us? And that's Norway. Let's move on to another part of this continent now, shall we? Oh hey Ireland. Oh, by Ireland. Lol. What about Canada over here? How are you? What about Spain? Maybe if we raise our army to higher numbers then you will be 100% frightened of us. Well, I have a good knowledge of what we are going to do in the next episode. Conquer Italy, Turkey and their vassals, or move into Asia. Both are so fascinating and exciting options. By the way, raising our army meant that Spain surrendered. Moreover, I have discovered in the past that by firstly vassalizing a country and then demanding its annexation, it will be easier for them to accept your annexation terms. More rebels, disgusting. Guys, um, we just annexed Canada. I told you this would work. We vassalized them first and then sent the demands. Works like a charm. Buy English Newfoundland. Time for Portugal. Let's additionally create some vassals from the colonies of these nations. Well, one downside of all these mass conquests is the fact that the citizens are not Germans. So we need to do a lot of assimilation work. And that costs money and time. Portugal surrendered at last. Let's release Angola as a vassal. I also forgot that they had Macau. Let's release them as a vassal too. Anyways, if you enjoyed our conquests today, smash like and subscribe for more awesome content like this and I will see you tomorrow. Peace lads.